You can now create your own TMNT islands in Fortnite. Everything from their mythic weapons, devices like the hoverboard, 150 custom props, and so much more. So my friend Birdo just posted a video creating a new TMNT island from scratch, and today I'm going to playtest it and give feedback to finish the game. Thank you to Epic for sponsoring, so you know I had to order some pizza. That's fire. We got the whole TMNT squad here, ready to go. All right, so first we got the skyscrapers, like we're uh, in the middle of New York, and then I put every prefab, huh? so clown time, and this is the Birdo building. Welcome. Whoa. Oh my god, it literally says Birdo. So the mythic is used, is, it's kind of like the shotgun where you want to like use it for close range. Hmm, okay. Oh. <laughs> Ooh, is this like a little one-shot arena? This is cool. one-shot arena. Oh, nice. Okay, so you can easily leave if you need to. And then, yeah, so these will get you, uh, there's supply drops that land all supply over the Supply drops. We'll oh, my you, nunchucks. Uh, yeah, open it. All of them have a oh. hunting rifle, so you'll have that for one life. Oh, where did my man just go? All the sewers in the map go to the same spot. They all go to mm. our base. Oh, nice. This is an NPC, right? The oh, shutter's exactly. locked up. All right, so what I would say is I feel like we could enhance the layer by adding like a special gun down here or something that you could get. Yeah, like a purchasable. Yeah, even if there was like a vending machine down here for like heals or something. Yeah, like a zero point dash. Oh yeah, that'd be whatever. good for mobility. Yeah, mobility items. Cause like right now the, the map is pretty big that I feel like, yeah, more mobility items, like, I don't know, crash pads or shock waves. Oh, yeah. So this map essentially is supposed to be, you know, free for all combat, but it's like mixed between short range gameplay with the katanas, the mythics, and then also the snipers. Oh, nice. Okay. And so then, there is mobility with the hoverboards. Yeah. Can yeah, I try that so out? Scoring. I'm going to eliminate awkward. So look at the scoreboard <laughs> on the right. Yeah. So how it's two points. Now eliminate me. All right, so I'm going to eliminate you. On the hoverboard. Oh wait, the score's messed up. So you're trying to have a system where if you're on the hoverboard, you get more points for an elim. Okay, that's cool. Dude, I haven't used these hoverboards in a while. Oh, there's a rift. Oh, nice. Okay, we actually really like that. So you have rifts for extra mobility. You can double jump? Oh, yeah, I, you forgot, can double jump. I forgot you could do that. Shoot, I'm down to play. I feel uh -huh. like you should add infinite tactical sprint. That's not, so that's that a good Yeah, it is pretty open. One thing I was actually wondering about, I remember seeing in the TMNT trailer, like custom VFX, like for, it was like nighttime or like there was different like shading. I wonder if we could experiment with that maybe. Yeah. So wait, why did the round just end? Because sir, someone reached a certain number five. of elims? Yeah, okay. I wouldn't necessarily know that like I have to get five elims to end the game. I wonder if we could add like an, a UI element potentially. I don't know, maybe something to make it more clear. Here. That makes sense. So wise. <laughs> All right, Furious, on. let's fight. Come on. Just Wait, me. a chili bottle. Does that do anything yeah. special, or is that just a is that just a chili was, bottle? That was my custom chili bottle that enhanced and made bigger for no reason. Should I put some hot sauce on this pizza right now? All right, let's go, Furious. Oh wait, do we both have Donatello? All right, so wait, I'm at three points. I need it two more, but Berto's better. Oh my gosh, the movement's crazy. How am Wait. I missing these? Wait, are we the same team? Hold on, hold on, stand still. No, 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 oh, no. we're not, okay. We're just missing. <laughs> oh, <laughs> we're not. Don't disrespect right. my game like that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, if someone's feeling extra ambitious, meet me at the sniper one shot right now. I was trying to encourage, you know, <laughs> oh, going shoot. for the supply drops because it's just the better sniper, you know? Yeah. Do you think it'd be possible to add like bouncers to the side of the arena too? Uh, Yeah, I could do that. Maybe not like fully like all over. Oh, oh my gosh. Not all over, you know, maybe like yeah, yeah, ones. I agree. Maybe like one on each corner. All right, who am I now? Oh, back to Mikey. Okay. Oh, I really like these mythics because you can like dodge around. Ah. Come on. Oh, get over here. Oh, God. <laughs> there we go. Let's go. Oh. I'm going insane with the melee right now. All right, I think we all team up on Dag. <laughs> no, 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 no. Oh. Ooh, took him out of Birdo oh, Tower. It. I wonder if we could add like powers too. Like maybe you get like a double sniper. Or maybe yeah, like the dashes or something. or something. Yeah, elimination streaks. Oh my gosh, wait, I'm at four points. I need this. Yeah, the main thing for me, I would say, is mobility. Furious made a good point about maybe infinite tax spin or just some way to be like, ooh, a little bit faster could help. Yeah, yeah possibly a power up that Increase makes you speed. move faster. Yeah, an ability. Or nice. if we want to actually give use to going into the sewers, put them in there. If you guys think we don't even need the sewers, like it's always free to like open feedback. Like, would you guys even want that or you just want to just keep biting? Uh I mean, to be honest, I don't really see a point in going there, really. <laughs> yeah, I think right now people wouldn't necessarily go there, but I feel like it's a nice break from fighting every now and then, especially if there was a reason to come down here real quick. Meet me in clown time. <laughs>
Meet me at Clown Town. What if like, I, have, I yep. put a hidden Easter egg only we know about, like, and you interact <laughs> with the button right here and it gives you, like, uh -huh. low, low gravity or something. Oh, just like, yeah, I like that. When we promote our islands, like, it's usually cool to have, like, a secret button that, like, people could see from our videos to, to get. Something not, like, too OP, but just, like, an Easter egg. In theory, this you could even turn this arcade into, like, a power-up room and maybe that would be, like, more visited. Oh, dang. <laughs> the rounds are going a little too fast. Oh, yeah. Yep. No, no, the score was just a test. Okay, okay. okay, so we could change that number. Yeah. What yeah. What do you guys think would be better? Like 20? 30. 30? Maybe like 30. I, th I think After 30 is kind of standard in uh, different gun games I've seen. I mean, especially with the hoverboards with the extra points. It rewards people who are trying to like play the game in a fun way to get double points. More hoverboards. Oh, oh the that mid -air. Was sick. <laughs> So go check out Birdo's video. Let us know in the comments what you would do so we can incorporate it to the final build.